I like this song. And it was today about it, guys. Well, it ain't about snow. This is the time that bikes do not go on the road. Anyway, <laughs> still cold. Um, what we're doing today, guys, cosmetics. So this is the one we've done up yesterday. I have some very nice decals. Should we go green or yellow? I, uh, I fancy yellow. Now, as promised, about the seat bucket on this, guys. Let me just go down a little bit there for you. Let me get to the bike. Um, I mentioned yesterday about this sick bucket being broken. Bit too loud, man. I did fix it, okay? He says, so cold. What I did, I put the clamp on that I said I didn't like, but I don't like it. So I'm going to take the seat bucket out. And as I said, I have this seat bucket here to go in, which works perfectly. And some nice white ones. I'm going to polish them up a little bit and put these on. Reason being is let's quickly go round the bike, shall we? Can you see that, guys, without going too uh, stupid on it? It is cracked, okay? Nothing here. So, although it's nice and black, and the front's nice, and this side is good, I'm still gonna do it. And there's the bucket. What happened, I put a bracket there, and it worked well, but look, when it closes, it's a bit far back, you have to push it down. I don't like that, and it's got a couple of rips in it as well. So we're gonna take that off. The back of the bike, uh, I like the matte black, to be honest with you. Um, it's not too bad. So we'll stick with what's here. So what happens next? Let me put this back up here. I don't mind this new camera, to be honest with you. It's quite good. Bit of me, there we go. Right, under this little bracket here, so it doesn't tip down. Remember guys, I've told you many times before about this. Four bolts are here, okay? And literally, maybe two here sometimes, and it comes off, and you've got the connector wire for the lights, okay? A lot of people ask why lights don't work on these. Well, it's bulbs, all these wires. You have to take the front off, guys, so you can get these bits here off. All right, so that's the next thing we're gonna do, is get these off now, and then put some white ones on it, and change the seat, so. As I say in all my videos, let's get on with it. These are simple guys, I know I said it before. I have to take the front off to get these off. There's a nut here, a screw here, one here, and one here. Now some of these do have under here as well, so you have to be careful, and one here. I've said it before guys in a lot of my videos, don't just go ripping panels off. If that don't come off, find the other one that's under here guys, all right? It's important. This is why I've done like speed fight threes, and I get quite a few questions recently on these. <laughs> um, my clocks don't work, or my speed don't work. A lot of my clock related, relay related, a lot, lot harder to find than these ones are, believe you me. It's so easy to get these panels off. The Mark threes, they really did mess around. <laughs> They really mess around trying to make them a lot neater and tidier, and I just want to make them a lot harder to work on as well. That's why I like these Mark IIs, they go so much faster. Anyway, let's get the screw under here, get these changed, put all the front back on, change the bucket, put some decals on and clean it all up, and then I'll show you in the snow, or maybe tomorrow what it looks like, but I'll drag this out in the snow. Remember, before putting decals on guys, make sure it's clean, don't polish it, just wipe them over, wash them with uh, all the new wash line liquids, make sure they're dry and then put the stickers on. Don't polish, because it might tear to it properly. Anyway, let's get on with it. Quick top tip guys, these wires, okay, it goes on here, make sure you're very, very gentle with these. They snap, then you've got to fray the wire and try and poke it through and you get on and off indicators. Bit of WD on these as well. Connect them up, before you put everything back on, Test them, okay? I've done it before. Wax it all back on, start the bike, forgot to connect the lights up, and one of these don't work. Always, always test once you've done it, okay, guys? Guys, if you're gonna be working on the side of the bike, jack the bike up, okay? Cut the blocks all underneath it, get the front wheel right off of it. This is what was wrong, this bolt here, this mud guard had come out. So I reshaped the washer that sort of goes around it, and then took it back off again. 
in a big old bowl to get that nut off, I tell you. The discs, look, they're wavy discs. They look great, but you do get this juddering effect. I've checked out the brakes themselves. Now, I didn't have brake cleaner. Please don't use WD-40. I used some carb cleaner on this, and I wiped it right off. And that now is uh, perfect. Very nice new front wheel on here. Um, bloody good wheels, to be honest with you. Anyway, a few decals. I do like my decals. I've gone for yellow, as I said, but I'll get about outside in a minute. But there you go, guys. White sides now, all front back on, and I changed the seat for the black one. So she starts, she rides. What I'm gonna do is get her outside, but come on, guys, look how crap that is today. <laughs> At least it stopped snowing. You know what? I might take it out tomorrow when it's a bit, bit less of a, uh, a snowy day, eh? But guys, if you're gonna work on these, have the space, have the tools. There you go, all sorted now. Couple of little stickers here and there. But uh, yeah, she looks very nice. Right guys, on this little bit, the last thing you do is show that she starts. Uh, kick start and electric start. So, key in. It is bloody cold, okay guys? Yes, it's in the shed. And that's the result, isn't it? Kick start. Oh yes. Do you notice she starts straight away? I've had people ask before, guys, why my bike takes ages to warm up. I know a bike you can jump on and race away. Choke, carb, plug, worn engine, so many things it can be. This baby is good as gold, mate. As soon as you start her, she flies. Plug um, was really, really dirty, but not that old. So I cleaned that, stuck it back in. The air fit was fine. I said I didn't do the carb on this one, although I always say service your bikes, which is a must, you know. Um, do that first, then look at other things. Uh, the guy messaged me last night saying, thank God someone didn't just say clean your plug. It was a Roland's clutch. Um, I've not often had where the clutch is jammed like that, but all the um, rusty looking colour, I had to look at it, and there you go, I found it myself. Right, I'll quickly take this outside tomorrow. Uh, show you what it looks like around the bike and that'll be this one finished I guess guys so let's get on with that little bit and here she is guys and girls all finished start rides does everything a little Peugeot speed fight is supposed to do guys check out my videos like and subscribe this is just a floor filler really just to show you that little bit of work changing a few things and they can look quite nice but it's snowing, so I'm not going to go ridings now, I know it rides. But for the straight front now, I think the panels don't look too bad being white rather than black. Three extra little decals on it, I think tear it off nicely. Like, subscribe guys, take care of yourselves on the road out there. Especially in this weather.